Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I do want to give you guys a quick update and let you guys know that from here on out, I will be uploading every Tuesday and Friday, so you don't have to wait for the notifications. You don't have to guess when I will be uploading again. I will be uploading every Tuesday and every Friday, just so you guys know. If you have not subscribed to my channel, definitely subscribe so you guys can get the newest uploads. So let's get into your reading, Libra. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for the month of June 2018, okay? Sun, Moon, and Rising. Please excuse my hair or my makeup. It's probably looking like trash. It's been a very long day. <sighs> Libras, Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising. All right, your general energies for the month of June 2018, Libra, is... What is it? Oh, the Two of Cups. So you have the Two of Cups here, Libra. The Two of Cups is passing, passing energy. Uh, what that means is that you may have already experienced this. The Two of Cups is definitely talking about unionship, partnership, but it's also talking about partnership in regards to business and finances, as it is a general reading. Let me pull out more cards to be able to... Oh, okay. So you have here the Four of Wands. Four of Wands is definitely talking about partnerships and relationships. The second card is the Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles is about balance. You have the Three of Cups here and the Five of Cups. Okay, so for some of you Libras, you may be experiencing that for some or most of you guys, you may be experiencing the elevation of a relationship. Um, what this means is if you currently have been dealing or dating someone for the past whatever, uh, you guys are definitely taking it to the next level. So there could be engagements. There's, there could be actually a wedding as well, as I do have here the Four of Wands. The Four of Wands is talking about taking it to the next level. And actually, if you've been dating someone in a long-term committed relationship, then you're taking it to the next level, meaning marriage or getting married with them or moving in. Um, the two of pentacles is definitely talking about balance, but I feel that this has more to do with your energies, Libra. So for some of you guys, it could be experiencing that there is this, um, getting together this type of celebration, some type of celebration that's coming right around the corner. Or for some of you guys, you guys already did this or experienced this in May. Nonetheless, um, even though there is a cause for celebration or a cause of, connectiveness with people in your surrounding circle because you do have here the three of cups so the three of cups is celebratory type of energy um again like i said i do feel very strongly for some of you guys you guys probably attended a wedding for others of you you may be working towards a marriage or some type of wedding or commitment um but you do also have here the five of cups and the five of cups definitely talks to me about mourning the loss of someone so for some of you guys it could be that you're actually celebrating um someone's like if someone recently passed away not recently sorry if someone passed away a relative or family member someone their anniversary may be coming around uh right around the corner if not it already happened and there's this celebratory type of energy where all the family or everyone comes together um for some of you guys it could be the announcement of an engagement or Again, like I said, moving in, but your energy may be a little bit imbalanced because it's like this feeling of mourning or the loss of someone overshadows the celebration. So it could be for some of you guys, if it is in fact you the one that's getting married um, or announcing an engagement, it could be that perhaps you have a parent that passed on or is no longer here uh, in the material world. Um, and it's almost like finally I get to celebrate and, you know, take this milestone uh, or make this milestone in my life and they're not here know and understand that they are spiritually with you and even though you may not physically see them they are around you i do feel that there's definitely a loss or a feeling of a loss um, for others of you it could have been the representation um okay for some of you guys it could be that you're currently going or you currently are experiencing um some type of miscarriage or the loss of a baby uh, and there's this feeling of fear i guess you're excited that you and i'm not talking about recently i'm talking about like in the past perhaps you guys you and your partner recently came to terms that you're gonna try but there's this feeling of over this fear that overshadows that illusion or that desire um 
know and understand that whatever happened in the past is in the past and whatever experience that brought to you take it for what it was whether it was good or whether it was bad um spirit has better plans for you and nonetheless again like i said i do see the materialization of some type of birth so when i see a birth uh, it usually represents um marriage it usually signifies moving in with someone or in fact pregnancy um but again i don't i don't feel I feel more that it's a birth of a new beginning. So again, like I said, for a lot of you guys, it could be that you're going to be experiencing um, the changing of status from being single or being in a committed relationship to actually living or moving in with someone or getting married. Again, like I said, know and understand that spirit is all around you. And this card here, the two of cups, if you can see it, I'm not sure if you guys can see it clearly, but there is this like very bright type of energy surrounding both of them. So I feel that this union or this connection is definitely um, being protected and being guided um, or you're being guided um, to commit to the person that you recently have been with or you've been dating for a while. Again, like I said, know and understand that spirit is letting you know that even though you may not have the person, um, the person meaning if it's a father figure or mother figure, it can also be a brother. If you feel or a sister, if you feel that at some point uh, they might be missing out on this new journey in your life, know and understand that they are with you spiritually. I know this may not resonate with everyone, but this is the message that's coming through very strongly. Let me try to decipher. For those of you Libras out there that have been having like commitment issues in the past, I feel that if you still, for those of you guys that are single and have had commitment issues in the past, the Two of Cups is definitely telling me with the Four of Wands that there's a person that's coming towards you and they may be a water sign as I do see water very heavy here in this reading. Water sign would be a Scorpio, Pisces or Cancer and I feel that this person is going to come into your life and you're going to feel a very strong pull towards them. You're also going to be feeling like um, there is this spiritual connection between both of you guys and almost organically want to evolve the relationship rather quickly. Know and understand that this person was meant to come into your life. And if you had commitment issues in the past, that is the past. Let go of the past. Let go of grudges. Let go of anything that has tainted you in regards to love and romance. And open yourself up to the opportunities and um, the blessings that are coming your way that perhaps for some of you guys could be unexpected. I do see marriage very strongly for you guys. So for those of you guys that have been single for quite a while and you're not currently seeing anyone, I definitely do see you guys for the month of June. Um, I do see you guys actually meeting a person that is has the same desire desires or aspirations as you do. And I definitely see them clicking very strongly with you so again it could be something that it's almost like a whirlwind type of romance where you get to know them and within a week you guys start dating and after like a month um be careful also if you're not trying to get pregnant for some of you guys it could be that within a month um you accidentally get someone pregnant or you yourself libra get pregnant so be careful with that but again i do see that this is a very deep type of connection. Um, this is definitely the person that needed to come into your life. If you are currently committed and have been married for quite a while, I feel that for the month of June, uh, there may be some renewing of vows. For others of you guys, it could be that um, there is almost this, like your partner is going to be very extremely emotional, wanting to communicate their feelings for you and that, like almost reassure you of their love for you um and i do see very perfect harmony and balance with the two of pentacles i don't see it as the need for balance i i see that for the month of june there's definitely going to be manifestations of harmony especially in relationships for you libras out there okay so i hope you guys enjoyed this reading like share and comment if you have not subscribed to my channel definitely subscribe and we'll see each other soon bye